Got away from them, not gonna even worry about it. Except until we run into another one over here. You know what, just, just vats, vats. Aim for the head, and just kill him. And his gun disappears. Okay, so, I didn't piss them off a rad scorp- Hey, you are really red there, guy. That's what you call a sunburn. That is a bad, that is a bad sun. It's like he got, like, roasted in Tabasco sauce, I swear. You know, Tabasco sauce is not a good sunscreen. No matter what anybody, no matter what your friends may tell you, it is not a sunscreen. Trust me. Not that I've ever done it, nor will I ever admit to have been doing it, but it is not, nor will ever be. Red Racer Factory? Neat. Probably not gonna do anything with it. But, I mean, it's still neat that we found it, right? We'll go to this eventually. Hmm. How close are we to the... It seems like we're getting pretty close, so... Is it... No, okay, so we can't go down there. Never mind. I was, being, I was like, looking at that like, wait, you can go down there? Apparently, you cannot. As soon as I click that... Really? F oh, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Run away, run away, run away and don't die. Jericho's unconscious, so... We're getting kind of close to where we need to be. <laughs> we're just getting chased by a literal magic shit ton of raiders. Yet again, they're right behind me. Kill him, kill him. Oh my god, just got one more. Now we've got like a hundred more. Never mind. There goes your axe, bitch. Get out of get out of vats. Get out of vats. He's closing in on you. No reason to just stop and stand around like a dumbass. Get the guy now. Get the other guy. Ooh. That has got to hurt. Oh my god. Really? You little piece of shit blew up my head with an axe. What kind of axe does that? Really, you... Ah, fuck. Uh... <laughs> it exploded my face. Good lord, man. It's like, my face was there one second, and then it was just in pieces the next. And we're dead again. Fuck. I just, I just don't know. We need armor. We need something. We need, like... We need Jericho not to be so... St stupid. <laughs> oh, I quick save bad, didn't I? Fuck it. I'm, I'm going this way. Not even giving a fuck. Not even, not even gonna attempt to. Hey, you know what? Since we're up here, we might not piss off those guys down there. Which means we'll be in better straits than we were before. Meaning, I am gonna fall to my death. Because, you know, invisible wall. It's just death after death after death in this video, isn't it? This is just a failure of epic proportions. Ah. Yeah, fuck checking that guy and he broke my leg you you know what we're gonna have to go down here but maybe if I stay really far over on this side and I stick myself with another bloody needle I not bloody as in it's got blood on it but bloody as in I'm annoyed because apparently I'm English now don't ask um we won't piss him off and we'll be able to get to where we need to go Hide in the bushes, hide behind the rocks, do whatever we need to do to not get sodomized by all the fucking raiders that are apparently in this area. Which, from my count so far, is at least a hundred. I swear to god. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's more like 30, 35. But that's still a lot of raiders. Like, that is still a ludicrous amount. More than we could ever hope to overcome. Considering how, you know, considering how dead-eye accurate they are. Like, it is. They just hit the bullseye. And that guy with the axe, too. Just 
blowing my head up like right back there is just that guy man that fucking guy okay so uh that exploded what are you alien power cell well, we're picking up raids raz here so apparently, uh, alien spaceship, Firelands, what the fuck is that? Alien power cell, alien power cell, what the hell is that? What is that? Fuck if I know, but it's cool looking. I mean, you know, just... Just, you know, just your average, everyday spaceship blow you know, alien spaceship blowing up in the sky, dropping off weapons for, you know, friendly tourists. Just, you know, normal stuff. Don't die. Thank you. Um, fuck it, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lift it look a gift horse in the mouth. It does not make any sound, though, when it shoots. And that guy got blown up because he got shot. Up, oh, we're dead. We're so dead. Uh, we don't have any ammo for it either. I think I'm gonna save my ammo for that. Ow, my leg. God damn it. Been sitting on it. Now that I moved it, it hurts. So we're not gonna go over that way. We're gonna we're gonna have to go around even farther. Just just pretend like we never even saw that. We don't. We only got like five ammo for it, which is kind of shitty. But I don't have much. You know, much we can even say about that, to be honest. <sighs> so, this helping the outcast stuff is uh, not working out how I thought it would. I thought we'd be able to go there and then, like, talk to some people, but we can't even. I can't. Well, not we. You guys probably know exactly where I am. Everybody always knows exactly where I am, except for me. I never know where I am. I feel like we're getting closer. I feel like I'm getting farther, actually. Yeah, I'm getting farther. Because <sighs> I'm trying to not have to interact with a metric shit ton of raiders, because can't really take them on just yet. And that's what I was hoping to get done with one of the DLCs, you know, get some levels as a turret. Grenade box, mine box, pulse mines. Well, that's kind of cool. I mean, again, gift horse, not looking it in the mouth. It's something. All right, let's see. I cannot wait while enemies are nearby. Fuck you, turret, just giving away my position every time. All right, let's just keep going around. Maybe find another way around into the into the outcast's place, or maybe at least find more raiders to kill. Picking off maybe one or two that sit on the outskirts of the raiders. I'm getting followed. I guarantee it, aren't I? Mm, I don't know. I can't tell actually, because I don't want to look back. Because if I look back, they're gonna shoot me right in the middle of the face. Because my face is the imagination. My imagination is so shitty. That it needs to be shot in the face. In the face. Oh, oh, hell no. Whoa, whoa. That's, that's mines. That's a death, that is a fucking death claw. Okay, let's see, can I skirt around the mines? Well, we got around that. Yay! And we've got like a nice protective barrier of bullshit. Jericho's unconscious. Spare skill not high enough for that. Don't know why. I thought it was high enough before, but apparently now it's not. Oh, hi. I think he hit one of his own traps. And uh, I think he's dead now. Sorry, Raider. But this area is mine now. 
The fuck is gonna hit me if I... Ow! It's a shotgun. Okay. Wish I had, uh... Saw that over there. Food? Food! Cram! Don't know what cram is, actually. I guess it's spam and just... You know... Just har har sized I don't know. Shotgun? Can I take the shot? I cannot take the shotgun because my repair skill is not high enough. And do not fall, because if you fall... Yes, I do. I'll come over here so I can shoot you. He's probably not going to let me shoot him, is he? I wouldn't let me shoot me. I wouldn't let him shoot me either. What? I wouldn't... What? Hold on. What? Oh. Ow. Son of a bitch. I forgot about the bear traps. I wouldn't let me shoot me either. And why is my repair skill not high enough? I could have swore it was. Why is it zero? Combat repair penalty? I cannot repair in combat, apparently. And he has... I thought he had a laser gun, but... Now, somebody's got a laser gun, and I might be dead. Yep, definitely dead. Definitely not dead. I survived. Fuck you two. Well... Um, okay. Things are not going quite as poorly as I thought they were. I mean, they're going pretty poor, don't get me wrong. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to have the room to throw this. I think I did it. Hot damn, I did it. There's a bear trap. Not let's not hit that. Even though somebody's already hitting it, hit hitting it. Wow, good job. You're, you're you're just English today. It's just amazing. Jericho's unconscious again. Stim pack, open. I can pick this. So it seems like everything is just going better than expected in this area. I don't even know how many stim packs I picked up. I picked up two apparently. Awesome. That is that is more stim packs than we've gotten in a while beer. This is locked, though. I'll take that. I will open this up with gusto. Come on. Come on. Thank you. Bobby pins, whiskey, Thorazine, blah, blah, bottle caps, bobby pins. Pretty much anything, everything decent, at least. Huh. This is a nice, neat little area up here this guy's gotten. Easy, hard, average. Easy. I can open up the easy one. I Nope. No, I cannot. Gun cabinet, lever action rifle, 10 millimeter rounds. Seems like everything is going better than expected here. Vintats. Braxo cleaner. Huh. Seems like, uh. Seems like everything's going pretty well, don't you think? I just need to pull out my laser gun and we can get going down a little bit, I think. Maybe actually. Do, do we get the repair penalty taken away? Yes, we did. So now we can actually do stuff. I will not, you know, redo that trap. I actually don't want it redone. But this one, this arm... Good job, Pat. You did good. Now, as far as all the mines go... I thought I heard, like, a gunshot. And I'm, like, uh, not a gunshot, but, like, a bullet hitting the ground near me. And I was about to be like, well, we fucked up. But we've still got that Deathclaw, who is somewhere, like, over there. Hitch, he still is. And he's at low health. As a low- Alright, let's go try killing that Deathclaw one more time. It's at low health. Maybe we can get- Like, killing Deathclaws, I remember, it gives a shit ton of experience. Since it's almost dead, maybe we can get a shit ton of experience off of it. If we can even kill it. It's walking real slow, though. And we did not get any experience for killing it. Fuck. Deathclaw blood. Actually, that's worth a lot. Its body exploded. 
Looking out for mines. Who are you? And why should I care? Wasteland Settler? Schematics for a Deathclaw Gauntlet. That's pretty neat. Take your hunting rifle, too. Schematics for a Deathclaw Gauntlet. Let's see what uh, we need to do then. That'd be kind of cool. You know, if I use that Deathclaw Gauntlet. Wonder glue, leather belt, medical brace, and deathclaw hand. Does what been your unarmed attacks will have a for Yeah, don't care. Moving on. No. <laughs> Alright, so. Maybe we're getting closer to the outcast thing than I thought. People's Republic of America radio signal? Hmm. Like, how far away are we from that. that, um. Okay, let's save. Let's go to the Red Racer facility. So imagine life in a vault tech vault, not just a future, a brighter future, underground. Okay, so good, we got Jericho back. Look at his accuracy. Come on, how do I compete against that? That is just. Ah. It's just like, from across the world, he just shoots and it hits me. It's like he knows all the fundamental physics of gravity and bullet trajectory. So he just shoots and then it, it just like, it magically hits me because fuck you, that's why. That's the feeling I get. It is getting dark. And if it's going to get dark, I think that's about where I'm going to leave it off for today. I hope everybody's enjoyed this set of Fallout videos, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. We're heading on to the Outcast place. Here comes Jericho, all sneaky, stealthily-like. And, like I said, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have fun out there, everybody.